Hey guys, I'm back. And yes, as you can tell, I have purple hair, but you can't really see it. I know this lighting is shit in my house. But anywho, I am back with another story time. This story time, I'm gonna be telling two. So this story time is about when I was still working at Wendy's. So let's just jump straight. Let's just jump right into it, okay? Okay, and yes, I am wearing lenses in my eyes, so if my eyes look somewhat bigger, I am wearing green circle lenses. But anyway, let's just get started. The first story is about how people always sleep in Wendy's. Like, when I was still working there- I don't know what the up with my hair. Like, what the hell is going on with my hair? But anyway, when I was still working there, there was this- when I went- when, when I was working one time, there was this one guy in the dining room who was just literally just like sleeping like it's like a bed. So you have the dining room, well the old dining room but they just renovated it. But the old dining room was just weird. It was, just, it was like a setup. But the way it was set up, there was like two booths and like right here. Like we're like right here we like walk past. I walked past and I saw this guy sleeping so I'm just like, okay. So instead of waking him up, I got one of my managers. <laughs> and my one of my managers was so scared. It was so funny. She just like and she came out and she's like, sir, excuse me, so you can't sleep here. And he got up, he's like, oh, oh sorry. And he just sat up. I don't know why people sleep in Wendy's. It's just I don't know. Maybe it's really warm. I guess it's warm. For homeless people sleep in there too, but we gotta they gotta wake them up too. When I was still working there, we had to like wake them up. I know it's sad and stuff, but we had to like wake them up. Uh, we had to wake that guy up. And the other, the next story is about this guy. When I was still working there, when I had a shift, when I was working, there was this guy at this big round table eating his meal and he was drinking a can of beer yes a can of beer in a wendy's restaurant i that isn't allowed i know because there was a big fuss over it when pe when he was and i was cleaning the table my phone just vibrated when i was cleaning the tables a customer came up to me and when i was doing, i was wearing my full-on visor Hair pulled back, hairnet, uniform, all black. I didn't have this on. I had to take it off because you know, Wendy, you can't wear choke because Wendy thinks you're gonna choke or something. I don't fucking know. But anyway, this customer walked up to me and said, "Hey, this guy is drinking beer at the round table." And I'm like, "Really?" And he, they're just like, "Yeah, he's such a rebel drinking it." And I'm just like, "What the hell?" I'm just like, "Okay, I'm gonna go tell one of my managers." So I tell one of my managers. So I walk and go get one of my managers and say, Hey, this a customer told me that this guy was drinking beer at the round table. And they're just like, oh, that isn't allowed. I'll just go and check. So one of the managers said, Hey, one of the one of our employees said that you were drinking beer. Sir, that isn't allowed at Wendy's. And he's like, no, 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 no. I'm not drinking beer. I'm drinking pop. And I'm just like, pop, dude, that's just a lie. So he was like, he said he was drinking pop, but in the end, he was actually drinking a can of beer, which is not allowed monies. So after that, there was like this big, like literally, I'm not even joking, you guys. There was this big fight in Wendy's, and I'm just like, oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. So the guy came up to the counter, and the guy's just like, I'm a pink. When he said he was, when they told him he wasn't, he wasn't allowed to drink beer. He had a fit, and he came up to the counter. I was right behind the counter. I was right behind the counter doing something. I don't know what the hell I was doing, but I was doing something. And he's just like, and he came up. He's like, I'm a paying customer. You can't treat me like this. Blah 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 blah. And he's like, and then one of my managers like, sir. Beer isn't allowed in Wendy's. You have to leave. You're gonna if you don't leave, we're gonna call the cops. And he's like, he's like, I want a refund on my meal. 
blah 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 and I'm just like holy shit this is intense I didn't say anything I was just watching the whole thing I'm just like oh my god the craziest shit goes down in Wendy's and he, he's like I'm gonna leave blah 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 I'm gonna have a refund on my meal blah 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 and and one of the employees is like sir you want a bag for your fries and she's like, he's like no she's gonna eat it and he like stormed off angry. I'm like, holy, someone was angry. That was crazy. But anyway, those were my two story times about Wendy's. If you want me to do more story times like this, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Okay, bye.